yeah, yeah, I'm okay with telling people, so let's just do a video. Hey guys, it's your fitness babe Tian, and welcome back to my channel. I'm her sister Jade, and she's my special guest for today's video. I have some big news, and the big news is that I'm pregnant. Yay! Jay is 30, like 34 weeks, going on 35 <laughs> weeks pregnant and I like no one can tell that she's pregnant. I was walking all the way until I was like 7 months pregnant and nobody, well in my 7th month of pregnancy and nobody noticed anything because obviously I had the best personal trainer to keep everything tight. I had like the best nutrition plan. I had like, you know, everything was really... Uh, well thought out. So when Jade first told me that she was pregnant, obviously I was thrilled and so excited. So I immediately went online and I got myself pre and postnatal certified so that I can take care of her, making sure she's healthy and strong during this period. And also, yes, and also for the baby. Which, be happy. which sister would take a course for you? Just. <laughs> just to get certified so that they could keep everything tight and thanks so much for doing this video because i think it's very useful to a lot of you know mothers to be i think this is a great video to show them you know you can still stay fit stay active and stay healthy throughout your pregnancy and even after that okay and honestly uh, like i never <laughs> i never had this line i never yeah. had that line <laughs> okay but i think this is like the fittest that you've ever been honestly yes <laughs> It's super weird because now that I'm pregnant, my fat has increased by like 2%. Mm -hmm. So there, there is some body yeah. fat increase. But yeah. my muscle mass has increased so much more than my body fat percentage. And I'm like so surprised. Doing my pre and postnatal course, I read up on a lot of different exercises. Like lower back strength and abdominal strength was very important for you. Yeah, but I mean at the same time, you also strengthen the other parts of your body. Like yeah. your arms and your legs through the workout. But she was so scared of losing her abs. And using like that flat stomach. I was really proud of that like center line yeah, that you yeah, have. Yeah. In the middle of your this stomach. Yeah. yeah. And I was like kind of sad that I was gonna lose it. But Super weird she... because now I'm like pregnant, right? Mm -hmm. And I and I have a baby like that's literally in my rib cage. Mm -hmm. But I can still I still have the center ab line yeah. and I still have the obliques. That's yeah. like, Pretty, I, 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 I'm pretty surprised. Yeah. And I'm, I'm just like, is this normal? Six pack pregnancy. Yeah. <laughs> Six I'm pack happy. pregnancy. So something else I've been very proud of Jade uh, about is the fact that she's been doing a lot of cardio. Um, yes. Almost every day, you know, she goes for a walk in the morning. She's been practicing, you know, pushing a stroller with, with, with my <laughs> dog inside. inside. Yeah. That <laughs> looks that I get. I know. Oh my God. <laughs> she's been doing her morning walks, her evening walks. So mm -hmm. yeah, I'm really proud of you. Doing that. But she still traveled quite a lot, you know. I think when we went to, we did we did Bali together. Uh, in Bali, she was four yeah, months pregnant. Four months. She was four months pregnant in Bali. If you see one of the vlogs, I'll put a link over there. And uh, I think it was Sydney, I was seven. In Sydney, she was already yeah, seven months seven. pregnant. And you know, we walked every day. I think we did like 15 to 20,000 steps every day. To be honest, it was really tired in Sydney. Like, 10,000 steps is a lot for me. <laughs> but I was with my sister and I was with Wayne. And they were like, let's just walk. Let's we'll just walk, walk there. We'll just walk there. It's long. It's not it's long. So it's like near. a. It's like. Do you know what she means when she says it's right there? It's twenty minutes away. <laughs> so I'm like dying, but I don't want to be like the pregnant burden. So I'm just like, yeah, what a nice day in Sydney. <laughs> and then at the end of the day, I look at my iPhone. And I don't know. Like, she still has yeah. To count on and it was like fifteen thousand. So yeah. I was like, good job, guys. We we've already burned off our lunch. So like, yeah. So I've been yeah. writing like a nutrition plan for Jade, and she's been very very obedient and good about it. My sister focuses more on um, making like food to make to keep my energy up. So I do take a lot of protein, mm -hmm. definitely. Um, quite low fat because I wanted to make sure my baby was gaining weight. Mm -hmm. um, milk protein was really important. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but there is a limit to how much protein you should yeah, have. Yeah, so you know what she did? She drank my whey protein. Uh -huh. She drank my she drank my protein shake. So I've been slowly trying to take yeah. in more protein. Yeah. For, like slowly trying to incorporate it into my diet. Yeah, so she's been she's, she's been taking um, things like chicken breast and fish. Uh, and something else that she's also been taking a lot of is lean beef. Because her iron levels are a bit low. We actually did a, a blood test and it's on, on the lower side. So yeah. So, yeah so 
I think it was very important that we incorporated more iron into her into her diet. So that comes from red meat. She just came off a keto diet. So yeah. if she was on the keto diet, it's really good for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just ate whatever she ate. My yeah, on the family. yeah on the keto diet, I was eating a lot of ground beef and steak. So she, yeah. I just gave her all my oh, meal prep so basically. Good. But I still, I still have the cravings. So that's really difficult. <laughs> she helps keep me in check with the sugar. Those Vicks um vapor vapor, rub. vapor rub. That's yeah, she, my craving. It's so weird. She's been craving those. Like it's such a strange pregnancy <laughs> craving, honestly. This is not a craving lah, but she's just been drinking her a lot of bubble tea like, like every day. Yes, okay, <laughs> but like, wait, you're feeding your child bubble tea before you're feeding it breast milk, okay? Yeah. But at the same time, I don't feel like the diet was very restrictive yeah. or anything. I, I I still ate. I ate more healthy than before I was pregnant. I was eating yeah. <laughs> you know, before I was pregnant, yeah. but uh. I feel I feel so much better. I feel so much healthier, yeah. and I, I hope I can maintain this lifestyle, like you know, after I give birth. Yeah, yeah, which but, is like gonna be the most critical period for you to maintain. But it I anyway. doubt. I, I doubt so. Well, no, I will keep you in yeah. check. So Jade, how long more till baby pops? Uh, the gynae has given me like a two to three week. Uh, period mm. where I could go into labor. I'm, I'm gonna be like the ch fitness tra cool fitness trainer auntie <laughs> to bring the baby to the gym every weekend. I am really just very proud of you for for keeping to the program throughout the whole time. And I hope that you know after baby comes out, you still continue to stay fit. Yeah, as anything, long as I can keep my energy up, I think it will be fine. Yeah, I think the most important is to keep energy up. And you know, if it's a happy mommy, it's a happy baby. Happy mommy, happy baby. On an end note, thank you so much. Because I was, I was, I was, you, I know that you don't like children. Like, she doesn't like children. She can't pretend. Put that in. <laughs> I like, I'm I like very, your children. Yeah. So I'm very <laughs> touched that you bothered to take the prenatal and postnatal class. Mm -hmm. And I'm very, like, the amount of time and effort that you put in into educating yourself mm -hmm. is so that I, I didn't have to. <laughs> it's quite amazing. And uh, I don't think I could have done it without you. So thank you. Alright. Don't cry. You have a lot of love and support around me. Yeah, I'm around very you. lucky to have all this, all this like love and support. Blue, like a mama, like a me, and Kimmy. I swear to God, I think and my like dog. Clarence. I think my dog knows that I'm pregnant. Yeah, she's because getting she really insecure. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. If and you have any questions, me, please me. leave them in the comments below, and my sister will do a Q and A. Yeah. I will see you guys in the next video. Take care, guys. Bye. Bye. Bye.